The Nigerian Senate has condemned the Monday seat at home in the southeast geopolitical zone and asked the federal government to collaborate with the Finnish government and extradite a pro Biafran agitator Simon Ekpa for prosecution. During plenary, the Red Chamber presided over by President of the Senate, Senator Godswill Akbabio, resolved to invite the Minister of Foreign Affairs when appointed and relevant stakeholders to carry out a thorough investigation as well as bring other sponsors of the ARC to book. Senator Osita had in his motion decried the state of insecurity in the region, stating that economic activities have come to a halt in the zone, while kidnapping and wanton killing had become the order of the day. The Senate is aware that thousands of innocent lives have been lost since this action of sit at home in the Southeast started. And properties worth over a trillion have been destroyed, which has resulted in investors leaving the region. Further aware that the sit at home civil disobedience action in the Southeast has led to the disruption, vandalization, dis disruption of economic activities as well as immeasurable financial losses for businesses, workers, and the total economy of the Southeast. Mr. President, the Senate is worried that if the activities of Simon Eber, who is issuing the illegal seat at home order, is not checked, he may succeed in corrupting the minds of Nigerian youths and turning them against the government. A cross-section of senators condemned the seat at home in the southeast geopolitical zone. I have called the market leaders in Abia and I said, you can't continue to stay away. And they told me that the people have threatened to burn their markets at night if they don't stay away. So this is beyond the citizenry coming out to just say we don't accept it. Because what they have done is to use terror tactics to intimidate a whole region. These boys have caused an industrial problem in our area. In where it represents uh, Senator Baribe, they are mainly manufacturers. In Aba is a manufacturing hub. None of the industries can open. People have suffered so much. If commerce, therefore, is shut down in this part of the country, I'm afraid it indeed a national problem that I think should be treated as a national challenge. We will work with the state governments. I don't know what our, the, their security vote is doing for. If they can use the, their security vote to, 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 to equip the local vigilante in my own local government, Mr. President, it may interest you to know that we've been able to nip them. Going, for four, going to four months now, there is no single incident of kidnapping in my local government. In Nebu North. Condemn the seat at home in totality, as well as the nefarious activities of one Simon Ekwa, the gang leader. Those in support of prayer, one say aye. aye. Those again say nay. Nee. The eyes of it. The seat at home order is said to be enforced by a faction of the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra in five southeast states Anambra, Enugu, Imo, Abia, and Eboi. The order was declared in 2021 to press home demands for the release of IPOB leader Namdi Kanu, who has been detained by the Department of State Services. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.